With Halo Reach being the last few days, I've had quite a bit of time to playtest it, and through my playtesting, I discovered that a lot of the key bindings aren't really the best for an FPS game. So, in today's video, we're going to be looking at what keys you should rebind in Halo Reach. This will make your gameplay a lot better, and it helped me a lot and made my gameplay go a lot better too. This will help you do better in multiplayer and enjoy the campaign a little bit more because you won't have to do any weird moves. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. The first key we're going to talk about is Crouch. Now Crouch, at the generic settings, is on the left control. Now as you can see this presents a problem, because if you're going to drop down from shift to left control, and shift is your armor ability, so sprint, shield, any of those, you're going to have to either decide do you want to crouch, or do you want to sprint. So my key recommendations are to switch it to C. The reason for C being is C is where your thumb is. C is just directly above the spacebar, and you're only needing spacebar if you're going to jump over something, which is not very often in PvP, firefight, any of those things. So, if you, I were you, I would remap this key to C. The next key we're going to talk about is melee. Now, traditionally, melee is on Q, and this presents a problem, because when you're in an FPS game like Halo, you want to have as much movement as possible, so you want your fingers on AWS at all times. And now the reason, with melee being on Q as a problem, because you have to take your finger off A and then move to Q, which means you'll lose one of your strafe directions, so you can only move one direction, and then become more predictable and the enemies will have a higher chance of killing you. So my recommendation is to move it to mouse wheel. The reason being is, since you don't have to lose any movement, you can still use melee but still be able to move everywhere. Melee has probably been the single most ability that has saved my life more times in uh, gunfights, so I would highly recommend moving it to mouse wheel. This is a really, really good spot for melee. Next key on the hot bench is Reload. Now, lucky for Reload, Reload is on R, and that, in my opinion, is a really good spot for Reload. It's not a hard movement to make with your fingers, so it is perfectly fine to stay on R for all I care. So, Reload, R, perfect. Next key is Grenade. Now, this one is an interesting one, just because this is more personal preference than anything. Now, in settings, Grenade is on G. Now, in my opinion, this is an awkward and a hard movement to make, because you either have to take your pointer finger off G, or lift your thumb all the way to G, which is, either way, kind of uncomfortable and awkward move, especially when you're trying to make it fast. So in my opinion, so that way your thumb can do all the work, or your mouse button and fingers can do all the work, I'd either remap it to V, or if you've got a gaming mouse, I would put it on one of your mouse buttons. So grenade, personal preference, put it where you like. Next key is E. E is the action key. Now. E is perfectly fine to be in the action key just because you're only doing actions to enter vehicles, pick up health, all that stuff. You're not usually going to be in engagement, doing engagements when you're going for E. So I think that this key is perfectly fine just where it is. The next key is, in my opinion, the most important key to change. If you were to not change any key but this one, just one, it would be this one. And this is the change weapons key. Now this one is on one. Now. One is kind of a problem, just because you're going to have to take your ring finger off A and lift it all the way to one in a kind of finger ninja kind of move. So, as you can imagine, this is uncomfortable and a pain in the rear to get to if you're trying to do it fast. So, my remap suggestions, I have three. You can either switch it to Alt, not a comfortable key for everyone, but I personally don't mind it just because my fingers gotten used to that after playing Destiny 2. Uh, the caps lock key. Caps Lock is not a hard key to get to, and it serves no purpose in a video game unless you're spamming chat. And the last one, and this is the one that I use, is a mouse button key on your gaming mouse. So two options if you're not a gaming mouse user, one if you are. Well guys, we've reached the end of the video. Thanks a ton for watching. I really hope this video helps someone out there just because I, I was already enjoying Reach, and after I had played around with the keys and remapped them, I enjoyed it even more. I really feel like that this will help someone out there. If you guys know a friend or someone who you think would benefit from a key remap, then please share this in this video. If you guys are new to the channel, we live stream every single day and upload videos whenever we can. We mainly stream Destiny 2, Halo Reach Now, and Star Wars games. Thank you for watching. God bless every day. Bye now.